Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, it's currently 10 after 7. Um, I had to go out to my brother and sister-in-law's house. Um, the one that were just over here the other day because I, something, I think Tim said his Xbox controller broke or something. I don't even really know. Um, I had to take an Xbox controller, a battery pack, and this like cable connector. I don't even know. It was all Xbox stuff. Um, I had to take it out to his brother. And we just spent some time out there. You know, just hanging out. Um, they made Ella a bag of popcorn because she was getting hungry and like she was indicating that that's what she wanted. So she ate some of it while we were there and then they kept telling her, well, you can just eat it in the car on the way home. I was like, nah, I'm gonna take it off of her because for one, I don't want popcorn throughout my car. <laughs> but also because um, if she, if she had it, she wouldn't have napped. So she ended up falling asleep in the car on the way home. And then when we got home, I ended up sitting in the car for like 25 minutes, sitting in the car so that she could nap a little bit longer. Um, so that's what I've been doing. I need to go get the fly swatter. Um, he and my nephew painted a couple of pictures, so he got that one, and then he got that one. So we brought those home. Um, I need to figure out what I'm making for dinner. I was gonna pull something out, ended up forgetting. So you know, there's that. Hopefully, I can get these guys. There's three of these moths up here, and it looks like they're trying to breed two of them. So we're just gonna kind of dick it in the butt because I hate these little things. Come on, come closer to the other two. Oh yeah. Um, so these things, they're called pantry moths, I think. They're obnoxious. Um, I've talked about them a couple of times. Uh, we're just we're still trying to kill them. I don't know where they're coming from, but they keep like, new ones keep spawning every day, I swear. It drives me nuts. But I had to stop and get some stick butter for Tim. I just got blue bonnet, it's an eight pack. Um, and I had to get some graham crackers. He was gonna make the cream cheese, but we were low on our good butter um, and I was gonna just get some there, but it was like eight dollars for a small tub that's like three or four dollars at Walmart. So we ended up not doing that. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna make tonight. Um, but yeah, we ended up not doing that or getting that because it was just way too expensive. Um, oh god, that looks horrible. So, we ended up not doing that. Um, I don't even remember what I was going to say, to be honest. But, I think I may... Pressure cook the chicken. And then put it in slow cook for this. I don't know. Dang it. I hate that. Like, I felt rushed out of the house earlier because Tim just, I don't know. Some days he, like, rushes me. It's like he wants me to leave. Um, I, he didn't even really help me out to the car, which obviously made me a little mad. But let's see. Broccoli shrimp. Alfredo. Do I have Alfredo sauce? Snap. I don't know if I got Alfredo. Oh yeah. Two jars of it. <laughs> uh, 
shrimp and broccoli alfredo is what I was supposed to make. I need to end up going to the store tomorrow. What is piccata? Yeah, I can't make that. We don't have white wine. Um, I need to go to the store tomorrow. I need to get four peaches and some hamburger buns. And then... Um, gosh, I'm like going crazy because my meal plans aren't lining up the way they should. Like yesterday I made the flavored pork loin with mushroom sauce. So I made that because I was supposed to make it Friday, but I don't remember. I think, yeah, Tim's friend was over Friday and they ended up getting McDonald's um, and brought some home to me. So it told me not to worry about cooking. So I was like, okay, whatever I was gonna make Friday, I was make tomorrow, which was Saturday. Then Saturday came and he wanted his wings. I ended up not making his wings because it ended up being too late because our, or his friend came over that night. And I don't know. So he made his wings Sunday. So I didn't make dinner Sunday, obviously. Um, so I made what I was supposed to make Friday um, on Monday. I think I'm going to do the shrimp and broccoli alfredo. How much, uh, oh, this is stressing me out. I need, it says fettuccine noodles, but I just like threw away like all of our noodles because these stupid pantry flies or moths. Eight ounces of pasta. Uh, I guess, I guess, I guess I'll use this. Angel hair spaghetti. It's either that or lasagna noodles. I think that's really all I have for noodles. Got these jumbo shell pasta shells, but that wouldn't be good. So yeah, it's going to have to be spaghetti angel hair noodles because that's all I've got. So, uh, you just look dumb with everything today, Shorty. <laughs> She's tired. She didn't really nap. But yeah, I'm going to get that done. Uh, her canvases came today, so I need to figure out which packaging those are in so I can show you guys. All right, so here's the canvas. Well, my battery ended up dying. So, <laughs> these are the canvases. They are... U.S. Art Supply says one unit do not separate because it's a 24 pack. So I got 24 canvases here. They're not the stretch canvases though. So uh, it's canvas or cotton canvas panel board. So I will get this opened up. And they are all... You can get it. They're all individually wrapped. You guys can see the light is reflecting. So they're all individually wrapped, which is awesome because then I can store them away and I don't have to worry about them getting dirty or anything like that. And I didn't know they came with this, but I can put like Ella's name and the date and stuff that she made them and it's like printed onto the back. So that's pretty actually pretty cool. Um, I could say Ella... Uh, you know 18 months and write the day on it or something like that so got 24 pack of canvases so this is a 12 pack do not separate um, but they must have just had two 12 packs together or something I'm not sure but yeah, these are the canvases and I am really happy with our purchase. This was, I think, $30. It's cheaper to get them from Dollar Tree. They're a dollar a piece at Dollar Tree. But for sakes of not going out of the house unless necessary to go to stores, 
I'll take it. Um, it was only six bucks more for the impact tire pack, which is wonderful. So Tim's like, do we need that many canvases? And I told him, I was like, well, you know, I can store whatever we don't use and her and I will be using canvases for a while. You know, I can make Mother's Day presents, I can make Father's Day presents, or more or less she can. Um, so I think I'm actually gonna put one of these, hopefully they'll fit, into one of our gar, gar not garbage bags, one of our gallon storage bags. And put paint on it, like inside the bag for like no mess reasons. This way um, she can like smear the paint all around and then uh, paint it, you know. Ah. No. <laughs> oh, you've gotta be kidding me. I think they are just too long. If I really try, I might be able to zip it. Oh man, that bums me out. Yeah, see it, it's too tall over here. Oh man. <laughs> this would have been perfect had I gotten a little bit of a smaller canvas. Um, I don't know, I'm still gonna fuss around with this and see if I can't get it to fit in here good. Um, I don't know, I'll let you guys know what I come up with. Figured it out, got it zipped. I left her popcorn over in this little place and then she can just kind of smear the paint around which is awesome. Um, I only did red, yellow, blue, and purple because red and yellow obviously make orange so the blue and the um, yellow make green and then I put purple because I think purple and or blue and red make purple but obviously she's not going to be really getting the blue up here so I just did that um, I did red yellow blue and then purple I didn't like offset them or anything like that but now she can just smear these and then like she can go to town like she is now um, and when it's all done, I can pull it out and she can look at it after it dries. So I'm really excited that I got that to fit. I do need to find something better. Um, I saw somewhere uh, they put like cling wrap and they taped it down like on the floor or on a desk. But my thing is I don't want her to get the paint everywhere. I want it to stay contained. So while she's entertained with that, I am going to hurry up and get some dishes done. All right, so here's the final outcome. It looked a lot better in the bag, but because the bag was so tight, I didn't have room to really like pull the bag away. So it kind of smeared, and then I wiped it that way again. I don't know. I think it looks okay. It doesn't look as great as it did. But that is her first mess-free painting masterpiece. Oh, I think she did a pretty good job. So I just counted her canvases and there's still 24 here. So she ended up getting a pack of 25, which is even better, but it was only supposed to be a pack of 24. I'll take it. <laughs> it's just that one extra canvas. So it's like, it was just like a trial and error type thing. So if I, if I didn't like them, you know, I could have returned them. But now I don't have to. That makes sense. Um, but yeah, so she's still got 24 here that she can color. And you guys don't believe me, you can count it for yourself. Let's get a good shot of them so you guys can count them here. So here you go. Still 24 there. This is what I'm making for dinner tonight. It's shrimp and broccoli alfredo. Um, I have the broc or the shrimp in some cold water to thaw. Um, 
Let's see the broccoli, the broccoli, three cups of broccoli, broccoli florets. Doesn't say if the broccoli needs to be like it says cook. So I just cook it according to the package and then chop it up that way. Um but I am hungry, so I don't I think I'm just gonna end up getting a couple sandwiches. Um, because I am like starving. It's just about eight o'clock. It's six minutes till, so I think I might just get a sandwich to hold me over until dinner because I feel like I'm starving, so yeah. Alright guys, so I just finally baked this ribbon and I'll have to come back tomorrow to find out the results.